so we hurried up over here to the leather sewing section. So this is a increasingly popular trend in lots of markets that touch leather. So this will include automotive, aerospace, um, furniture as we see here. And what is so cool about this is that we're now able to mix, and, and for the sewers that are out there kind of seeing this, this is going to be um, a game changer. You know, what has gone on in the past, whenever we're dealing with like leather or any type of a laminated material, when I say laminated, I'm talking about like the foams that are underneath to create um, space and, you know, batting so that you've got this sort of dimensional effect of the leather, is sewing it with a normal sewing machine, we're able to put down this very heavy upholstery thread. And, you know, laying out some beautiful, ornate patterns is always difficult for a manual sewer. You know, you're having to, you know, run your leather from one direction to the next, and you're gonna have to snap lines, follow those lines. Um, so that is uh, unique and difficult to reproduce, and now that we're using um, a machine to do it, Obviously, we're able to create some incredible um, detail and quality. But what's even more remarkable on top of that is for the purists that are out there that really know how to kind of look at this and appreciate the fact that we're able to perfectly register embroidery with those sewing designs. So mixing that uh, media together was of particular interest to some of the very high-end automobile companies, um, some of the aerospace companies that want to start offering things that are you know, previously just impossible to do. Because if you can imagine somebody, you know, stitching out a nice uh, quilted pattern of some type and then trying to frame that up and load it into an embroidery machine would be nearly impossible, you know, especially with this kind of detail work. So yeah, we can see a bunch of samples over here that uh, kind of really show the versatility of this work. Yeah, absolutely amazing. Absolutely. And again, you know, just the dimensional effects of, of some of this work is outstanding. Uh, you really have to kind of come from the sides because every direction that you look at it, you get different levels of shading. So this is like kind of reminds me of a like MC Escher-ish kind of, you know, looking at it from different perspectives. This one is super cool as well where, you know, by using rows of stitches, it's really kind of matted it down without it being a total fill. Um, Some of these patterns are just cool and amazing. So you're going to see um, a lot more of this kind of emerging in the market because of the precision. Yeah, look at the beautiful numbers. embroidery work. <laughs> So of course we have to jump over and show you that, you know, not only is this breakthrough something that's propelling the leather industry forward, but now when we're talking about, you know, back to the automotive market, when we're dealing with, you know, of course the rage is air conditioned seats, which means that we have to have not a, uh, a glue laminated material to kind of stand that leather up, but we have to use a spacer material, something that allows the airflow from the HVAC system to come through. Um, and then, of course, perforations in the leather. So again, beautiful dimensional effects, you know, very similar to what we just looked at. In production, of course, on a 24 needle two head machine with a massive 700 by 700 per head. About 27 inches or nearly 30 inches of sewing field. And you know what's unique about it is that we're setting up 12 colors of sewing thread and 12 colors of embroidery thread. So again, we can do that kind of combination embroidery and sewing thread effects in one pattern. Very, very cool. Now, this is what I was kind of alluding to about using a, a spacer material with a perforated leather. So, for those who aren't familiar with the process of um, doing that, once you make your perforations, of course the, the holy grail again behind uh, doing this sort of combination work is making sure that there's perfect registration between the sewing thread and the perforation. So, um, of course the problem is with leather is it changes. You know, every stitch that's made there is a bit of displacement that goes on. So sewers, 
that are trying to register perforations with sewing uh, really, really, really struggle because you're having to kind of change your um, line directions. You know, you can't follow a perfectly straight line because again, every stitch you're, you're moving the material slightly. So ZSK thought, how do we do this? And the correct way and the only way is ZSK's now patented solution of taking a photograph in during the process of the embroidery. Now, yeah, you heard what I just said correct. It's taking a picture, redigitizing during the process of embroidery so that the machine and the system can actually measure and calculate the movement that the leather's made while stitches are being put into the leather. So it can it's make those tiny adjustments on the fly. Microscopic, micro adjustments that will um, change the, the direction of the stitch, um, you know, in, in very, very small increments so that they're not really detectable by the eye, but then again, when you're, when you're finished, you're getting, you know, perfect registration. So, um, very, very, um, you know, some companies have produced machines that will combine perforating with, um, with sewing. Um, and of course, without being able to, to measure and adjust, you know, on each stitch, um, you're going to always suffer a little bit on the quality, but um, not with this. Very, very outstanding achievement by ZSK. Hi, how are you? Good, good to see you. Yeah, good to see you. Hey, Bonnie. Hi, how, how are, are you? you? <laughs> this is Bonnie. Say Hello. hi to our, our group. We're Hello, I'm Bonnie. <laughs> yes, <laughs> I live now in Germany. Yeah. <laughs> the American who ran away. Yeah. <laughs> okay, well, yeah. we'll see. Uh, we'll, we'll go over to the next section for okay. here pretty soon. All right, great. It's nice to meet nice you. Nice to see you. Bye.